folks. This is JTML9681. This is a testimony video that I must bear. Things within God's Word, the Word of Yahuwah, have never fallen more into place than they have since Barack Obama and Donald Trump have been in office as President of the United States of America. This is very heartbreaking. Because it took me over 30 years of my life, from the day I was born till sometime after I turned 30 years old, to realize the truth. And it took a little bit more time after that, because I'm 37, I'm going to be tw uh, 38 on September 6th of this year. And I've learned so much more in these recent years from when I became born again at age 30 than I ever have in my entire life. And anybody who has not truly born again will never understand. The Christian faith is not a faith of religion. Religion is something that you decide that you want to give a, a try, a go with, and see how your life compares. Christianity is not that way. It's not supposed to be that way. Christianity is supposed to be a way of life. The Christian faith can only be a way of life if you have a personal relationship with Jesus Christ, Yahshua HaMashiach. Sadly, there are people who have led the Christian faith who are denouncing and it says in the scriptures that those who denounce were never of us to begin with. They may have been with us, but they were not not of us. And especially in the United States of America, God, Elohim, the one true Elohim, Abba Yahuwah, the Father, Yahshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ, and the Ruach HaKodesh, the Holy Spirit, are being replaced with people's own desires. And this has been preached so much. It's been in the scriptures, and people just never understand it. And here's the thing. You can never, ever be born again if it is not true in your heart. You can claim that you are born again. You can claim that you're a Christian. You can claim that you are a believer all that you want. But if it is not truly in your heart, you're fooling yourself. And Satan has really been doing a number. And people don't even realize they're being manipulated by Satan. I do apologize for those who have been waiting for Bible studies. I haven't been posting any. Just wanted to throw that out there. The time is going to happen that those of us who are true to the Lord, that we will be up, up in heaven and then the most horrible tribulations that the that this planet would ever have to go through will end up happening while those of us who are true to the Lord will be in heaven during those seven years. And even I know for a fact there's going to be people within my blood family, people I know, whatever, who all claim that they believe in Jesus Christ and they're Christians, you know, and all that. And they may I may not see them in heaven. They're going to have to go through the tribulation. And I may not see them after that. Because even through the tribulation, they may not truly believe. They're only through dead religion and their own desires. And it's sad. I cannot make anybody... Make it, I cannot make any a decision for anybody. I cannot force anybody to choose. Everyone has to choose on their own. It's very sad and heartbreaking. And that's what's going on right now. And they try to say that the religion that has the most members or the most people who, who even consider themselves as, that, as, the, as such, Christianity being the highest, I guarantee you one thing, it is the lowest. Because only so few, by comparison of everybody in the entire on the entire planet, it's only going to be so few who are actually going to go to heaven during the tribulation. 
And how many are going to come out of the tribulation? Probably even less. Because so many of the world still won't believe. Times are very, very short. And we have no idea how long it's going to be, how much longer we're going to have. And remember, time with God is infinite. So, that's what I wanted to say. I just wanted to put a, a testimony video out and ask everyone to pray for everyone. We need to pray for everyone. It's not going to get any better. We want it to, yes. But things may cease or die down a little bit, whatever, or it may look a little better, but it's not going to get any better. It's going to get worse. So we all need to pray. I'll have links in the video description for social media if you want to follow me on social media. I bear this testimony in the name of thy son, Yahshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ. Amen.